Hey guys, welcome to another level two algebra viewer question. Uh, this was sent to me through Facebook, I believe. Um, really, really lovely question here. And um, yeah, so let's have a go at it. Uh, just a bit of a heads up for you guys. If you are looking for some resources in terms of practice work and tutorials, um, check out my website on the description. Uh, there are some great resources there for you guys to uh, for revision and so on. But anyway, let's get to this question here. So the first thing we want to do is we want to actually get rid of that square root symbol there. To get rid of that square root symbol, we need to figure out whether we can write this um, entire thing as a fraction. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to write that square root symbol and I've got 4 take away 4 over x plus 1 over x squared. Now because x squared is the um, common denominator, I am going to make everything into x squared as a common denominator, which means I'm going to multiply the denominator here by x, and I'm also going to multiply the denominator here by x squared, because remember 4 has a 1 below it, so I've got to times that by x squared. And so when I do this, uh, what I end up with is square root of 4x squared minus 4x plus 1, and that's all of it has the same uh, x squared as its denominator, so that's what it's going to look like. And that's all now divided by 2x minus 1. Now the next point is kind of um, looking at that 4x squared minus 4x plus 1 and looking at it and seeing that actually it's um, a perfect square. Because normally uh, the way they give these questions, if they give you a square root symbol, that means something in there, sh you should be able to square root it. All right, so you kind of just have to have a play around with it, but um, if you recognize the numbers, then you can see that 4x squared minus 4x plus 1, you can actually factorize it. Now, this is one of the like the little tricks that I use, which is going backwards, uh, going into polynomial unknown is 2. Of course, it doesn't work. That's because I was pressing the wrong 2 there. So we've got 4, we've got minus 4, and we've got 1. So as you can see, it's telling you that there's actually two roots of 0 0.5, right? So if it's x is equal to 0 0.5, or we want to write it as a fraction though, 1 over 2. Because uh, if you look at it, 1 over 2 is right there. So then we want to rearrange this. So this is going to become 2x is equal to 1 and 2x minus 1 equals to 0. Now that means our quadratic here is going to factorize to 2x minus 1 and 2x minus 1. So what we are going to do is we're going to replace this 4x squared minus 4x plus 1 with 2x minus 1 squared. So this square root is now going to look like this. 2x minus 1 squared divided by x squared and that whole thing is divided by 2x minus 1. And because we've got squares there and square root symbol, we can get rid of the squares and the square root symbol to rewrite it as 2x minus 1 over x squared, and that whole thing is divided by 2x minus 1. So at this point, we can rewrite this as a fraction, 2x minus 1 over x. Sorry, that should have been x, not x squared. Because square root of x squared is x, divided by uh, 2x minus 1. Just keeping in mind that this 2x minus 1 is here, and the top one is, oh, sorry, wrong color. And the top one is ending up here. So basically all I've done is I went, whatever is in that red bracket is divided by 2x minus 1. So, and at this point you can, if you remember, when you're dividing by something, you can actually multiply it by its reciprocal, which means I'm going to multiply by 1 over 2x minus 1. Now, because I have 2x minus 1 as two common factors, I can get rid of them, which leaves me with the final answer of 1 over x. So this particular question here, when it's simplified, we are going to get 1 over x as our answer. All right, guys, that's basically it for this video. As always, don't forget to like this video and, of course, subscribe to keep up with the latest content. One favor I could ask is could you please share this video with other people because there's a lot of people that don't realize this resource is out there. Some playlists are popping up. Check them out. Great revision material. As always, thank you for watching.